Let's balance the equation C57, H110 O6 plus O2, that gives us CO2 plus H2O. We'll also look at the type of reaction. Let's start with the type of reaction. We have this hydrocarbon here, it's combining with oxygen and we get carbon dioxide and water. So this is combustion, we'll call this organic combustion. That's the type of reaction. To balance the equation, let's count the atoms up. That looks like this. The thing to be careful about is we have six oxygens here and two here, so we end up with eight total. Over here we have these two and then this one oxygen and water, so we end up with three. Make sure you count those right. Everything else is pretty straightforward. So we've counted the atoms up for our equation. Often when I see something like 57, my, my inclination is to get that to be an even number. And that worked out pretty well, so I'm going to put a two here. So now I need to update these numbers. That'll look like this. So now I think I'll balance the carbons. If I multiply CO2 by 114, those will be balanced. I do need to update the oxygen atoms. So we have 2 times 114, that's 228, plus the 1 times 110, 110. This will give us 338. So now if we can get 338 oxygens on this side, we're good. So think of it this way. 12 plus some number equals 338. So we could just subtract 12. That would give us 326. So 12 plus 326, that'll give us the 338. So we can change the coefficient in front of the oxygen here, and that won't change anything else. So 2 times something gives us this 326. That number is 163. And we're done. This equation is balanced. This is a pretty complicated equation to balance, especially because you have these larger numbers here. But that's how you balance C57 H110 O6 plus O2. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.